Hey, so a few quick things about Udonja. What is Udonja? Udonja is a multi-part process where you test for your black belt. Now, there's a number of different steps that are included in this, and the first step of going to your very first Udonja is your goal of earning the deputy black belt. The deputy black belt is your first step. That means that you've tested on half of your total curriculum for certified first degree black belt, and you've passed that test. Your next Udonja will happen six months later, and that's where you test for your conditional black belt. This is where you get a solid black belt, um, and you still, you still earn the stripes on the belt, you still go through the curriculum for another six months, and then you go back and test on the third Udonja test. This is where you recap everything that you've done um, and need to increase your score on from the previous two Udonjas and you get your certified first degree black belt. This is where you get it, your name embroidered and you don't no longer earn stripes on your belt. And that is the beginning of your journey to black belt. Now, the reason I say that is because there's more than just one degree. You can earn a second degree or third degree by earning stars, by continuing to take Udonja and test at Udonja as the years go on. And you can continue to take your martial arts learning higher and higher. Now, a lot of people say, well, what am I going to expect? I've never been to Udonja before, or I've been to some Udonja prep classes, but I never made it to Udonja before. What is that? Well, the first thing is, is you need to know that we host Udonja prep classes. And about a month before Udonja, a month and a half, we're going to start giving out these letters. This letter is going to detail what classes that we're going to host that are above and beyond your regular curriculum classes that are specifically designed to prepare you for what is Udonja. Udonja is a very physical experience and may require a little bit of extra training at home. This might mean you're checking out some YouTube videos, you're practicing your self-defense move with mom or dad, or you're even doing things like running or extra jumping jacks. Um, the Udonja prep classes are typically longer than your regular class, and there is a minimum requirement of four Udonja prep classes in order to be eligible for Udonja. But that does not mean that if you make four different Udonja prep classes that you're going to be eligible. You still have to earn your instructor's recommendation. Um, if you want to know if you're on track for Udonja, talk to your instructor. Say, hey, I've been to three or four Udonja preps. What areas do I need to work on? We'll be more than happy to communicate with you. The next thing is, is you have your Udonja packet. This Udonja packet is designed to take you through all the different requirements that are expected of a person who is going to earn their certified first degree black belt. And that includes things like community service, uh, CPR certification, writing an essay of what it means to be a black belt to you, and what training in martial arts has done for you in your life. There's a number of other things that are gonna be included, like your physical requirements and expectations. And you're gonna be expected to turn one of these packets in at each Udonja. Each packet is gonna have slightly vary in what's gonna be expected of you. And uh, that's where we're at right now. So if you have any other questions about Udonja, just speak to your instructor and we'll be more than happy to answer your questions.